So this is where we left in the last video and we'll focus more on the security aspect. Let's open up your terminal and we can bring this up, bring the terminal up and here we're going to install one more package which is called Helmet which allow us to solve pretty much a lot of problems. So we'll have to install this package and just wait. Helmet package. So simply clear the terminal and bring this down and let's utilize it. So first we have to install it. So let's write it down. So we'll take helmet and it's coming from helmet. This is the package we have installed. Looks pretty good. Simply copy that one, bring it up here. And this the best place is to call here because this is the best place because first it will run and then the other thing will run. So we'll say use and that we have to pass that helmet. And that's it. This one is actually a middleware. If you look at this package in a in a GitHub, you will find that it's a middleware, and it will set a couple of property in your header. So here we have to simply let me just give this comment. So it's for rate limit. Simply grab that one and let's come here. And this one is called for let's change this to secure header. So in that we have to send the data. So we have to send the limits that how much data we can expect in our API. So as you can see that the user are uploading data. So we don't want more than 10 gigabyte. But if you're using the same API for other applications like movie, music or a PDF download or upload in that scenario, obviously you're going to allow them to add heavy files in MBs. But it's a simple document. We are adding a JSON file, JSON data in the JSON format. So that's a very light. So that's why we'll go with 10 KB. So that's the rate limit I will set here in my express. This looks fine here. And this looks good. This is the limit. So let's make it to 100. And this is the helmet we have. And now we can test this out. So right now you can see earlier when we made a request, we got this 11, 11 response in the header. But we'll have more if we call now. So let's come to the body, hit the request. And here we got the data. If you can see right now we have 22. And here you will have all this data. So content security policy, cross origin, border policy, all this data is added by this helmet package. So that looks pretty good. And these are the very important things because some when someone will use your API in their applications, so this thing will help them in the policy security. Otherwise, they can't use your API. So let's come back to the API package. And here you can see they have this bunch of methods. These are the default methods. So you can specify that what methods you want to use by typing all this value. But by default, it will automatically imply all of this value. You can see all of this value by default. Here you can specify that. So these are the methods you, you can call it individually. So there is a lot of things come and check from your end. But the default is fine to use. And that's the only thing I want to cover in this video. Hope you guys have got the idea that how you can set the headers in your API. With that, let's move to the next video.